Hello, this is Guy 7 and in today's video, I will be showing you how to build the Minecraft uh, New Year's cape from 2011, which all players were, were, were wearing on New Year's Eve 2010. Also, when you are ever building one of these capes, I was, I was going to say that I'm going to show you how to put them on in a video today. So, over here, we have, um... Mr. Testkin, and um, the way you want to attach the cape to your human statues is what you want to do, go to the very top block and have them attached so that they're sticking out right below the head and one block to the right and left like this. So it should drape down all the way to four blocks below the legs, or if you're just building these as statues, you can ignore that. But to start the cape today, the blocks we're going to need are block of raw gold, yellow concrete powder, block of gold, purple terracotta, purple concrete, purple wool, purple concrete powder, magenta concrete powder, magenta concrete, pearlescent frog light, and block of amethyst. So we're going to be doing it row by row, and to start off, we're going to start off row one with a raw gold, then two purple concretes, then a raw gold, then two purple concretes, then a yellow concrete powder, then two purple concretes, then a block of raw gold. Also, this is the simplified version, which I'll be showing you how to build later. Layer two, you want to start off with two raw golds, then three yellow concrete powders, and then three raw golds, and then two yellow concrete powders. For the third row, you want to start with a yellow concrete powder, then two purple terracottas, then a purple concrete, then four purple terracottas, then a purple concrete, and then a yellow concrete powder. For the fourth row, you want to start off with a yellow concrete powder, then a purple wool, then a purple terracotta, then a pearlescent frog light facing up, then a purple concrete, then a purple terracotta, and then a pearlescent frog light facing towards you, so you, so you have the top texture facing out, then two purple terracottas, and then a raw gold. So this is what it should look like right now. Okay, uh, pause if you need to. Now to start off row 5, you want to start off with a block of gold, then two purple wools, and then a pearlescent frog light facing towards you, the same one as this, and then two purple wools, then a pearlescent frog light facing up, and then a purple wool, then a purple terracotta, and then a block of raw gold. Okay, I'm just going to grab a sip of water first. Okay. Now for row 6, you want to start off with a yellow concrete powder, then a purple wool, and then a block of amethyst, then a pearlescent frog light facing up, then a purple wool, then a block of amethyst, then a pearlescent frog light facing up, then a purple wool, then a purple terracotta, and then a block of raw gold. For row 7, you want to start off with a yellow concrete powder, then a magenta concrete powder, then a purple wool, then one amethyst, then two purple wools, then a block of amethyst, then a purple wool, then a magenta concrete, and then a block of raw gold. For row eight, you want to start off with a block of gold, and then a purple wool, and then a magenta concrete powder, and then a purple concrete powder, and then three purple wools, and then a magenta concrete powder, and then a mag one magenta concrete, and one yellow concrete powder. So this is what it should look like now. Pause if you need to. Okay. For row 9, you want to start off with a yellow concrete powder, then a purple terracotta, then one pink concrete powder, then two purple concretes, then one purple wool, then two pearlescent frog lights facing towards you, so this way, then one purple wool, and one yellow concrete powder. For row 10, you want to start off with a yellow concrete powder, then a pink concrete powder, then a pearlescent frog light facing towards you, then a magenta concrete powder, then a purple wool, then two purple concrete powders, then two purple wools, then a yellow concrete powder. For row 11, you want to start off with a yellow concrete powder, then a purple concrete, then a magenta concrete powder, then a purple concrete, then a purple concrete powder, then three purple wools, then a purple concrete powder, and then a block of gold. For row 12, you want to start off with yellow concrete powder, then two purple concretes, then a purple terracotta, then two purple concrete powders, then one purple concrete, then one purple wool, and then one purple concrete powder, 
and finishing it off with a block of raw gold. So this is what it should look like now. Pause if you need to. Okay. Now for row 13, you want to start off with a block of gold, then a purple concrete, then a magenta concrete powder, then two purple terracottas, then a purple concrete, then a magenta concrete powder, then a purple concrete, then a purple wool, and then a yellow concrete powder. For row 14, you want to start off with a yellow concrete powder, and then a purple terracotta, and then a purple wool, and then purple terracotta, and then a magenta concrete, and then a purple concrete powder, and then a purple wool, and then a purple concrete powder, and then a purple wool, and then a block of gold. For row 15, you want to start off with a yellow concrete powder, and then a purple terracotta, and then two purple wools, then a magenta concrete, then a purple concrete powder, then a magenta concrete, then a purple concrete powder, then a magenta concrete powder, and then a yellow concrete powder. Now, to do the final row, you want to start off with a block of gold, then two yellow concrete powders, then a block of gold, then two yellow concrete powders, then two raw golds, and finally two blocks of gold to finish off the first design, which is the less detailed, which is the detailed version. Now we're going to be building the less detailed version, which in my opinion is the one you should build because this one's a lot messier and stuff. But then this one also does look a little weird on the bottom in my opinion. So, build whichever one you like. This one just uses less blocks. Also, if you would like to, you can join the Discord, which is in the description. So, you want to start off this one with a yellow concrete powder, then two purple concretes, then a yellow concrete powder, then two purple concretes, then a yellow concrete powder, then two purple concretes, and then a yellow concrete powder. So it should look like this. Next, for row two, you want to start off with two yellow concretes, then three gold blocks, then three yellow concrete powders, then two blocks of gold. And when I said uh, yellow concrete for one of these, I mean concrete powder. For row three, you want to start off with a yellow concrete powder, then two purple concretes, then a purple terracotta, then four purple concretes, then a purple terracotta, then a yellow concrete powder. For row four, you want to start off with a yellow concrete powder, then two purple concretes, then a pearlescent frog light facing up, then a purple terracotta, and then a purple concrete, and then a purple, uh, pearlescent frog light facing up, and then two purple concretes and a yellow concrete powder. So this is what it should look like right now. Okay, row five. You want to start off with a gold block, then two purple concretes, then a pearlescent frog light facing up, then two purple concretes, then a pearlescent frog light facing up, then two purple concretes, and then a yellow concrete powder. For row six, you want to start off with a yellow concrete powder, then a purple concrete, then a block of amethyst, then a pearlescent frog light facing up, then a purple concrete, then a block of amethyst, then a pearlescent frog light facing up, then two purple concretes, and a yellow concrete powder. Okay, for row 7, you want to start off with a yellow concrete powder, then a magenta concrete, then a purple concrete, then a block of amethyst, then two purple concretes, then a block of amethyst, then a purple concrete, then a magenta concrete, and then a yellow concrete powder. Next, for row 8, you want to start off with a block of gold, then a purple concrete, and then two magenta concretes, then three purple concretes, and then two magenta concretes, and a block of gold. Okay. So this is what it should look like now. Pause if you need to. Alright, now for the second half, we'll start off with row 9, which is a yellow concrete powder, then a purple concrete, then a pink concrete powder, then two magenta concretes, then a purple concrete, then two magenta concretes, then a purple wool, and then a block of gold. For row 10, you want to start off with a block of gold, then a pink concrete powder, then a pearlescent frog light facing up, then a pink concrete powder, then a purple wool, then two magenta concretes, then two purple wools, and finishing it with a block of gold. For row 10, you want to start off with a block of gold, then a purple wool, then a pink concrete powder, then a purple wool, then a pink uh, purple concrete powder, then two purple wools, then a purple concrete, then a purple wool, and then a block of gold. For row uh, 12, you want to start off with a gold block, then two purple wools, then a purple terracotta, and then two purple concrete powders, then a purple terracotta, then a purple concrete, and then a purple wool, and then a block of gold. So this is what it should look like now. Pause if you need to. 
Okay, row 13. You want to start off with a block of gold, a purple, then a purple whirl, then a pink concrete powder, then a purple terracotta, then a purple concrete, then a purple terracotta, then a pink concrete powder, then a purple terracotta, then a purple concrete, and then a yellow concrete powder. For row 14, you want to start off with a yellow concrete powder, then a purple terracotta, then a purple wool, then a purple concrete, then a magenta concrete, then a purple concrete, then a purple terracotta, then two purple concretes, and a block of gold. Row 15 starts with a yellow concrete powder, then a purple concrete, then two purple wools, then a magenta concrete, then a purple concrete, then a magenta concrete, then a purple concrete, then a pink concrete powder, and then a yellow concrete powder. Now for the final row, you want to start off with a block of gold, then two yellow concrete powders, then three blocks of gold, then two yellow concrete powders, and finally to end it to two gold blocks. So that is the New Year's Cape for today, and tomorrow I will either have another random video or the next cape in the series. And remember, this is how you're going to attach them to a player statue, or if you're just building these separately, just have fun like that. So, I will see you next time. Bye!